time no see. I've kind of ticked because I just recorded this video, or I thought I just recorded this video, and it didn't record. Cool. So I gotta do it all over again. So it's basically a March Favorites haul. March Favorites and a mini haul. Ha. So let's do that again. I'm so pissed. So anyway, my first favorite that's always in every favorite video that I do. It's the L'Oreal Liquid Intense Extra Intense something about it's some eyeliner that I love. You've seen it, you know it, you love it. The end. Then, this is awesome. This is an e.l.f. eyelid primer, which is comparable comparable to um, the Urban Decay Primer Potion. And uh, I like it a lot because it's only a dollar and not $20. And it works just as well, if not better, for me at least. I'm not sure what that noise is. The cat's freaking out. Anyway, next staple is mascara. And this is my new favorite. Wow. It's the Voluminous False Lashes by L'Oreal. Awesome. I used to use the Voluminous Million Lashes, I think it was. And then I started using this because I bought the wrong one. And I made a happy mistake. Very good. Then this. Everybody writes and raves about this, but I never pick it up, and I finally got it, and I love it. It's the Jordana Fabuliner, and that's the uh, swatch of it. It's so super dark, and it does not budge at all. Okay, nope, see, it didn't. So, uh, awesome. This is a new favorite of mine. It's the, Lor no, what is this? Maybelline Color Tattoo, um, and it's in bad, the bronze, and it's so awesome. Very pretty color, very shimmery, bronzy color. Stays put, grays the base. Can't go wrong with that. Love. And then this is my first China Glaze Polish. Love it. And it's super awesome. It's the, um, it's on the Hunger Games collection, and it's called Electrify. And we'll get into the Hunger Games a little bit later. It's, you've probably seen a ton and a million of these reviews, but it's just gold and red shimmers. It's very different, very cool. It looks awesome over black and awesome over red or on its own. So that's awesome. Um, and then I got a couple of these. This one I bought for St. Patrick's Day because I needed some greens. It's the Wet n Wild Color Icon Palette in Cool as a Cucumber. Awesome pigmentation, great colors. And then today I picked up one from Walgreens. I haven't tried this one out yet. This is the Spoiled Brat palette, and it's got some really pretty colors, and it's got that pink and that sparkly uh, black and gray, so that's going to look really cool together. And then also for St. Patrick's Day, I picked up um, the Wet n Wild Mega Liner, and this one's in turquoise, but it kind of looks green to me, so uh, that's whatever. And that's the color of it right there. I love the applicator. The brush is so so nice. It like goes on so well and it makes somebody who can't put on a liquid liner like me look like a fucking pro. Can't beat that. So after I found how much I love that, I bought two more. I bought the blue color. This one can have a little bit more pigmentation to it. It's a little watery for me, but that's okay. It's only $2. Whatever. There's the blue and the, the green. And then I also bought this sparkly brown. Uh, black one. And this one is what I've been wearing constantly. And it's on the bottom there. I don't know if you can see the shimmer in it, but there's really, really chunky sparkles, but you can't really feel them on your lid. Very nice. Very nice. Um, what else? Um, my go-to fragrance of the month slash season is my Peace and Love and Juicy by Juicy Couture. I don't really care for floral scents. Uh, I have the DKNY, uh, what is this one called? Uh, Fresh Blossom Juiced. It reminds me a lot of this, but I bought this at TJ Maxx, so I really didn't have a chance to smell it before I bought it, but I like it. Um, it doesn't wear the same as the DKNY I did on my skin. It's a little more citrusy and more floral than what I'm used to from them, because, you know, their scents are a little more musky, like, uh, their original is a little more musky to me, a little more, uh, darker, I guess would be the word. And then also I use a lot of my, um, 
Couture Couture Juicy uh, Body Lotion, which is very nice. Okay, that's all for my favorites, um, but I did pick up something I want to talk about um, today at Walgreens. They have a special going on two for seven, which is a great deal because I think they're close to five bucks a piece on their own. What is the EOS Shave Cream? I have one in Pomegranate Raspberry and one in Vanilla Bliss. So I'm going to give these a try and see how much I like those. Um, oh, hold on. Stop. Other favorites. My new phone. This is an HTC Resound. Um, probably one of the best phones I've ever had in my life. Very fast, sleek. My husband's trying to get a hold of me and I'm just ignoring the hell out of him. Um, and yeah, it comes built in with Dre Beats Audio and it also has the Dre Beats headset slash headphones in with it. So, very nice phone. I'm not an iPhone lover. I'm not really allowed to have an iPhone because my brother is uh, very against Apple. Long story. And then. Another favorite of mine. I've jumped on the bandwagon, kids. The Hunger Games series. Amazing. I haven't read since I was in seventh grade willingly. Like, I hate reading. But then I started to hear people talk about it. I saw people talk about it on Tumblr or uh, Pinterest or whatever. And, um, yeah, I am in love. I uh, finished the first two books. I'm on Mockingjay right now. I'm about a quarter of the way through. So, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do when I'm done with the books. I'm going to be so sad. I have nothing left to do with my life except wait for the freaking movies to come out. But, um, yeah, if you need something to read and you have been living under a rock and have no idea what I'm talking about, take it from me, somebody who hates reading. This is a must read. The movie doesn't do it just... The movie's a great movie. Don't get me wrong. But there's so much that's in here that's not in the movie. Trust. So, um... You can get the first uh, copy for, like, I got it for six twenty nine at Walmart. And then the other two, I believe, are less than 13 bucks at Walmart, which isn't bad. I mean, whatever. Um, so, yeah. Sexy. That's my little haul slash favorites video. I will be getting back into the swing of things. I have more time to now. I'm not on midnights anymore. I'm not baking at 4 a.m. anymore. I'm actually a manager full-time now, so I'm actually um, working in the morning and have the rest of the day to myself for a change, so that's exciting. I um, think that's all. Yeah. So, any comments, questions, or concerns, let me know, and I'll see you soon. Bye!